Hey guys, welcome back to episode 3 of The Walking Dead, The Long Road Ahead. Um, I got to play a little bit into it, but I'm having save problems, which is common for the game, evidently. So I'll know a little bit of the stuff ahead of time, and I apologize, but everything should work out fine. It's pretty fucking hardcore, though, I can't tell you that. Oh, pardon my swearing. I'm trying to keep that rated PG here. Not really. Going for our daily jog. I love it. Daily jog time. With a gun. In a zombie apocalypse. I am really enjoying the series. Like this is our lucky day. I got a friend who was asking me why. Yeah, this might actually go smoothly. We deserve it after last time. We know it won't go smoothly. I got a friend, he was asking about all the cutscenes, and I said it's kind of like a choose-your-own-adventure more so than a first-person shooter. It's not really a first-person shooter, as you guys have all been able to tell. Oh, man. Lee, where do you come down on staying or going? You mean, packing up the motel and getting in the RV? Yeah, we've been talking about it, but have you made up your mind yet? We should go. The motel's run its course, and it's not safe. you damn right it has. We pile into the RV and don't pull over till we see water. And if Lily's dead set on staying, then, well, that's the way it goes. Screw Lily. <laughs> Dude, we're fucking out of here. See, the okay, chopper was not there like last time. time. Over the rig, into the pharmacy, and scrape together whatever supplies are left. We didn't leave much in there. Hey, we're out of options. Something's better than nothing. I do like how it kind of jumps forward. You okay? and you don't the ladder's see every little thing. I'm not sure how many more trips she's got in her. I'm not sure how many more trips we've got in us. No kidding. Ah, shit. Okay. Let's look around. Let's look at the ladder. I'm not going to be able to climb, I'm sure, but... He'll say no. You know it. Looks like she's had it. What now? I'll find another way up. We better get a move on. Hmm. Okay, looking, looking, looking. I'm pretty sure the barrel won't help me. Hmm. Oh, I guess it'll let me push the jeep up. Lily's not doing so good, huh? She'll be fine. You really think so? I don't know, man. I've been thinking and... No. I just don't know. And what is it with the we killed her dad? I didn't kill her dad. That's bullshit. Really? You're going to make me attach it? Huh. Okay, quit humming. Huh. Hmm. Winch control. Your girl still upset with me for taking stuff out of that car last week? I hope not. She'll get there. I still don't think it was cool we stole it, but you know I'll eat it. As long as it wasn't me that stole it. Okay, make sure there's nothing else back here I need to worry about. Hmm. Um. <laughs> okay, dude, that's... Huh. Duck was asking about that guy at Herschel's farm last night. Really? I wasn't sure it phased him. Of course it did. It was a scary situation for him, Sean dying and all. I'm just worried he'll always think it was his fault. Now you yeah, obviously sure think you're it was your fault, so I guess I should press Lee, I'm fine. I've got this. Give me your hand. 
Really, Kenny? Why are you being a dick, Kenny? Jesus. Are you okay? I'm fine. Shit. I'm sorry, pal. I thought it'd be healed up better. You're lucky it wasn't any worse. You could have. No! No! Go away! Go! That's not sounding like a real zombie. Help me! Somebody help me! Oh, hey, it's the same zombie. What the hell is that? A walker? Walkers don't scream, do they? Jesus, I don't think so. It's a girl. We have to help her. How? There's no getting to her. We gotta do something. Fuck. We gotta shoot her. Put her out of this mess. I know we're here. What do you mean? I mean... We leave her alive, and she draws them all to her, buying us time. You can't think about it. We're always worrying about the ones we can't see. She stays alive and brings them all out of their holes. This time, because I went against him a lot last time, and this will buy some goodwill. And Go. she's already bit, now. and I'm an asshole. I'm sorry, <laughs> shit. I feel bad now. I should have shot her. Okay, yeah, it probably wasn't the right thing to do. We should be good to clear this place out, but we ain't got all day. Get everything you can out of these racks. Don't forget underneath the counter this time. I'll clear down here and then we gotta go. Okay, yeah, that was a mistake. I should have shot her. Because it wasn't gonna let me shoot a zombie. That's the only thing I do know about having gone through this is it won't let me shoot the zombie. She's gone. There's not much time now. proudest moment. I shouldn't have done that. I should have shot her. Damn it.
Oh, evidently we've been attacked a few times. I do like that it doesn't cover every minute. Oh, and she's going crazy. You're back. Clementine ben found some crazy. stickers in a drawer, and I put them on my walkie. Hey, sweet pea. That's neat. I'll find you in a minute. Looks like we got the kid on watch again. What'd you get? We might as well leave a sign out that says the men are gone. Come and rape our women and children. Ha. Huh. Really, so, dude? That was sexist. what did you get? Oh my god. Just what was left. Which was a lot, actually. Take a look. We're fine, by the way. Nice work. This'll keep us going. If we carry on like this, we'll get through the winter here. The winter? We'll freeze our asses off here! Because piling into an RV with you two, after what you did to my dad, is so appealing. Why wouldn't it be? You know I'll do what it takes to keep everyone safe. We're already safe. We have to go eventually, Lily. We don't have to do anything. You didn't want to go because of your dad's health. But he's gone now. Easy, Kenny. At it again, are we? Can it, Carly. Don't boss people around. I'm sorry. Somebody needs to make executive decisions for the group, though. And I don't think you're capable anymore. And don't start with me, either. Ken, we're all losing it with the attacks and lack of food. We're strongest together. It can't be you versus us, Lily. We're sorry for what happened to your dad, but we're in this together now. What about the food situation? What about protection? What about when this place falls? Somebody's got to be thinking about this shit. How has this not been working? We have everything we need. Because of me, Lily. That's BS, Kenny. And you... We got plenty of food from that station wagon. You didn't even want to take it. Where the hell would we be now? We can't just keep our fingers crossed for more station wagons. Everything that happens to us is another excuse for you to pull this crap about leaving. All I want is a week of peace, of not <clears throat> hearing it. Do you know how we got these supplies? We got lucky and let a girl get eaten out there. What? Some girl came screaming out of an alley. She had dead hanging all over her. She gave us enough time to get everything we could out of the drugstore. And you just let her suffer like what? Like bait? God, what is happening? It was a mistake. We got our supplies, but we should have tried to save her or put her out of her misery. Well, you had Kenny with you, so some options were off the table. You should be thanking Lee for not shooting that girl. It's not so easy for him. Look, Macon and its people aren't savable. It's not a town. It's full of walkers. And the people who were left are dying and wandering out onto the streets. It's hell on earth. And it's coming. This way. It's not going to be easier out on the road! How would you know? What I know? I know you're not above murder. I know somebody has been stealing our supplies. That's right. Stealing! And I know the list of people I can trust here gets smaller every day! Now everybody get out! She'll get over it. She's riling everybody up otherwise. You understand, Ken. She's right about one thing. None of this is getting any easier. Things are coming to a head. You could Just because you look like Sarah Connor. Well, I think you did good today. And I find myself thinking that most days. Thanks. It's probably worth following up with Lily about what she was saying about missing supplies. With her wound up the way she is, I don't want to see her paranoid. No question. And I'd like to talk when you've got a minute. Ooh, talk. She's kind of cute. That'll work. And it's not like there's a lot of women left anyway, so. Oh, that was sexist to me. Well, I guess not, because there's not a lot of men left either. Okay, let's go see Sarah Connor.